Hello and welcome to Driver's Therapy. In today's video, we are going to be testing a couple of different sunshades for the NSX. So Max is going to start us off. Max, what do we have first? It looks like we have an Auto Americs section. And it gives us some instructions and a bonus gift as well. It has a nice little opening over here. We can take it out from here. And wow, this is a nice little Nice little packet they have here. Okay. Then I have an Econor. Wrapping looks a little different. Uh, this looks a little bit more like saran wrap kind of wrapped around rather than this nice smooth plastic. So I think I might just have to tear this open to get to the instructions and the actual item. Okay. It's wrapped well. I'm gonna get scissors. I have scissors. Ooh. We can take it out from here. We can take it out from here. And it's free. All right, this one, this one. It looks like they're kind of the same, actually. They do feel pretty similar. Okay, we've got that part figured out. We're gonna get rid of some of this wrapping and see what's inside. Okay, now it's the moment of truth. We've gotta open these and see how they are. All right, Max, how is Auto Americs? All right, let's see how it is. It's black, it's, it's pretty nice. Mm -hmm. Let's try and open it, see how it goes. Whoa, <laughs> that's quite, whoa. <laughs> It's pretty nice looking. It is. And they gave us our bonus gift too. There is the bonus gift, the non-slip item catcher mat thing. Okay, they came through on their promise. All right, my turn. Econor. Looking pretty similar. It's got a wrap on it too. I think yours does as well. I just don't think it was attached. Oh. All right, all right. Let's see if I can do this. Okay, not too bad. All right, so we both have a black side, looking very similar. Silver looking inside as well. And a nice silver side for that reflectiveness. Okay, let's compare our silvers. Let's see, mine has a logo on it. Yours does have a logo on it. Mine does not have a logo. Oh no. Okay, come closer. All right, but the material looks pretty similar. It's got some tension, okay. How about the black side? Fold in. Same as well, it looks the same pretty much. I agree, I think they look pretty darn similar. We're gonna see if they fit the same too. Okay, so now we are going to see how well this fits in the NSX. Silver side out. Silver side out. Oh, I think we're upside down. Oh no. All right, hold on. I think they do have a cutout for the rear view mirror. There we go, yep. So the circles are kind of overlapping in the middle and sticking out a little bit on the sides too. These little flaps are kind of fun. They give you some extra coverage space. Yeah. Okay, I think that might be the best we're gonna get. Let's go ahead and show everybody what this looks like inside and out. All right, from the interior, it goes nicely down to the front of the dashboard. We do have some gaps up here at the top where the blue part is but it mostly covers, overlaps a little in the middle, and we did get it inside the edges. All right, and from the outside, again, it mostly covers things. It certainly is doing a pretty good job of covering the dash. I think we could work that middle part a little bit better to get better coverage. And we do still have a little bit of space at the top as we saw inside, but actually most of that is covered by the mirrors as they've been flipped down. So this is how our Auto Americs did. It looks like this doesn't have a cutout, unfortunately, for the rear window. So. Well, we'll see how that works out. Yeah. Might be better, might be worse. Yeah. All right. All right, so silver side out means we need to unfold. Yeah, there we go. We got this. Okay. And good news, this is very pliable and pretty safe feeling, so I'm not gonna 
injure the vehicle. <laughs> this one pretty much covers it all. All right, I'm gonna stuff the center part a little bit better than last time. Okay, and then we'll take a look at what it looks like. Okay, for this one, um, I'm not sure how much difference the cutout or lack thereof makes up here with the rear view mirror, but we'll see better from the outside. We did get this to fit in. We did go ahead and push the front piece down a little bit better this time. So that I think is similar on both of them. We just didn't realize it at first. So let's go look outside. And on the outside, I think this one looks like it's a little more squished, which is probably that the circles might be a little bit bigger. It looks like they reach a little higher up and down. And again, we manually pushed the front forward a little better, so we got a little better dash coverage, but that I think would be equal on both of them. Okay, now it's time to see if we can get these back in their wrappers. Max is gonna go first with the Auto Americs. All right, let's see how this goes. <laughs> The All twist right. and fold. <laughs> Apparently this one's a little harder than this one. That one is. It's got a little bit maybe tighter of the metal wires. This one's a little bit easier to maneuver. But of course they're both fun and spring-loaded. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can fit them in the bags. Alright. They look like big cookies. <laughs> Shiny cookies. Whoa. Now we have our package. They're both here. Okay, so we have a opinion to give you, um, kind of. Max, go ahead and tell us our pros and cons of the Auto Americs. Uh, the pros of Auto Americs is that it has a cutout. It's easier to handle the car, but one of the cons is that it's pretty hard to fold up. That's what I would say. That thing is definitely harder to twist. This one, uh, for the pros, we think it fills the space better in the car, which does make it actually a little harder to handle in the car because it is just a little bit bigger in terms of those circular diameters. Um, but it is a lot easier to manhandle and fold back into its little bucket. But you know what? The Auto Merics did come with the non-slip extra prize gift, so yeah. there's that too. But um, I think as a whole, they're kind of a toss-up as far as which one's better. <laughs> They feel very similar. I think their reflective properties look a lot alike, and uh, that's about all we can tell you. Yeah. But give it a try if you want to. Let us know what you think. And as always, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.